Hi guys, it's a beautiful day today, sunny day. Um, if you're looking into getting yourself more USB ports, possibly because your computer doesn't have enough, if you have an old USB port, uh, you just want more, you want more, you're not maybe two or three. Like my computer here is just a mini board. It comes with just four USB 3.0. And if you need to add more to yourself, probably you have an old system. You can try to get something like this. Um, this is PCI Express to USB 3.0. This is what is in the pack. We got five parts here and you can extend with two more from the other side here. Um, there are a lot of different brands out there that are making this, not just only the one I have with me here. So I'm not going to be giving any names, but I can put links down below if you're looking to get yourself one. So from apart from this, which I have set on the table, comes two cable. And these cable are basically meant for power, to power uh, the board itself so that your USB that needs more power, the hungry ones, they don't fail while you're recording or doing anything. And we have a mini CD-ROM, which is very nice. Not much of a paper here. This is just what they have. So I'm gonna put this one aside now and talk about these power ports. This is the SATA power, the ones of the new generation. And this is the old one. And um, what you do, it's you use one of them you don't have to use the two of them just you need just only one and this can power two of this card at a time maybe you have another card that needs to be powered you can use this and if you look onto your computer power pack you got the Saturn, which is the new ones everybody is using now which can be connected to this in this way or the old one which is this which also can be connected to this. You can use um, any of the two. You can use either this one. You can use this one if you have even got this SATA pack or pack on your uh, power pack. You can use it. And this actually goes into uh, this side so that you can power this modular card, uh, PCI Express card uh, from your power pack after you've installed it into the computer. So both, both of them are doing the same thing, just different connector or connection. So you use whichever one you're gonna be enjoying or you have on your power pack. So we're gonna be using the new one and connect it. So how do you connect it to the computer is what we're gonna be doing now. Why do you need it? More extension, more USB ports, and how do you connect it? That's what we're gonna be doing now. Okay guys, um, this is the back of my uh, system. As you can see from inside here, I have just uh, two PCI Express slots that are available to me. And on the split here, it's gonna be number three and number four. So I'm gonna use number four because it's closer to down. And the card goes in from let me turn it here so you can see very well. That is the slot here that I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna push it down in, and that is it, it's just in. So the screws goes in to just uh, put it in place. Uh, let me just use this for the main, main time, and um, just to show you for this uh, video purpose. And that is done, is in place. And the power pack I'm going to be using is this um, new modern one. I'm going to connect this to my power pack from the back of the casing. And this goes basically into here. That's all. For cable management, you can decide to uh, put it together. Or if you know you're just going to be using one, you can just cut it out and push back this ones inside here. So basically, that is everything you need to do in connecting the PCI Express card for uh, your motherboard into any motherboard. That's just done, everything is done and you have it clean in the back. 
So for me, if you ask me why I'm using it, I have pots on top of my casing, but I don't like to have anything coming up on potter on top of my casing. I don't like to have a lot of different things showing from this top. So I like to have everything just behind and uh, being covered up and more clean and my top is free for maybe just some simple things I need to do very quickly and very faster and uh, yeah so guys that is it for the pci express if you're just interested in getting one i'm gonna put a link below for you to get one so i hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you on the next video Odabo.